If you're thinking about becoming a game programmer, some of the subjects in high school that you could be thinking about taking would definitely be keeping up with maths into year 13. Uh, year 13 calculus is a big one. Doing some science subjects, uh, especially physics, uh, is really going to be helpful as well, and any computer classes that you can take too. Any kind of programming that you do, even if it's unrelated to games, is also going to be beneficial. If you've done any web development, um, any HTML, although that's not what we're teaching and what we're doing, getting your mind to think um, logically along those lines is going to be helpful when you come to making games. Game programming would suit someone who wants to make their own video games, they want to learn how to program, and they want to do so with a strong software engineering foundation for this. We're not about just teaching game engines and telling you what to click and showing you how to use um, you know, a, an interface. You're actually learning C++, you're taking math classes, AI classes, physics classes, you're learning these things from the ground up and then you're applying them on your own projects. The fact that it's project based and driven by your own ideas and your own games and you're working with artists to bring these things to life makes this a really amazing course and it's something that's completely unique in New Zealand. To apply for the programming course you don't need to provide a portfolio but we do request a letter of intent. Something to tell us, to let us know who you are as a person and why you want to come and study here. Making games um, is a really specialised field, it takes a lot of time, it's a lot of work and we really want to make sure that we get the right candidates. You might want to talk about your experience in school, you might want to talk about the kind of games you would like to design and create. If you've made anything before, anything programming related, you may even want to mention this in your cover letter or CV as well so we can check it out. The great thing about learning game programming here is that you get a strong foundation of mathematics, of game development, um, in some ways computer science and it's something that you're able to transfer to different industries. You'll learn to make games, but the skills that you get will let you work in other fields as well. Equally, if you're already working in a different field, in a different tech industry, you might actually benefit from coming and studying at MDS um, to boost your skills towards game development.